Hi, I'm Brenda. I'm the Assistant Branch Manager at the Antwerp Sunshine Branch of the Van Buren District Library, and today we are going to make Dragon Puppets. And when you stop by the library this summer to pick up uh, your books for summer reading, you can also ask for a kit that will have all the supplies that you need to make this. And in your kit, you will receive the template for your dragon, You'll receive a little baggie that will have all the supplies that you need in there. And in that kit will be two straws, um, a piece of ribbon. You'll have some sequins to uh, dress up your dragon and also some little wiggly eyes. And the first thing you want to do when you get your template is you want to cut these four strips out. And when you do that, you'll have this when you're done. You'll cut out your dragon and the wings and when you do that you'll have your dragon that will look like this and what you're going to do next is there's a solid line right there in the middle of your dragon's body you're going to want to cut that on both pieces and then you'll also see there's some perforated lines um, that are there you'll want to bend those back on each part of your dragon and then you're going to, once you've got that done, then you're going to glue the body pieces together. So we'll find our, our head of our dragon. And we're going to glue those together. Match those up. And you're going to want to leave those parts that you bent, where that perforated line was, you're going to want to leave those bent so that it looks like this. So you have two little flaps on your body and then you're going to do the same for your tail. You're going to glue those together. And again, you're going to want to bend those flaps back so that you have two flaps that look like that. Now when you get to your strips, you can use just two or you can use all four. But you're going to glue two of them together up at the corner so they look like that. And then what you're going to do is you're just going to bend one up and then back and then bend it down and then over itself just like it's going to look like an accordion when you're done. So you're just going to kind of bend that down and then bend it back. Just back and forth is what you're going to do. So that they kind of cross over each other as you're bending them. This one will go up and then back and as you see it goes down. You just got to kind of keep bending until you get to the very end. And what you're going to have when you're done are, is a piece that will look like this. If you just want to use one piece, you're just going to do the two strips. If you want all four strips, you're going to have two pieces that will look like the accordion, and then you're going to want to glue those two pieces together. Let those dry for a second. And then you're going to take those two flaps and put some glue on those. And put those glue that to one end of your accordion strip. So he'll look like that at this point. And then you're going to do the same thing with his tail. And you're going to glue those two flaps onto the back of his body. So far, that's what your dragon is going to look like. And we can't forget his wings, so you're going to Put some glue on the very end, or I should say, on all your wing there. And you're going to glue that down. And then you can put some glue on the other wing and match them up so that he has, he has his wings now. Now if you want to dress your, your dragon up a bit, that will give you um, your googly eye is here. You're going to peel the back. These are all self-adhesive. You're going to glue the back or peel the back of that off so he just sticks on there just like that. And do the same with the other eye. 
you have some sequins that are also self-adhesive. So if you want to dress them up a little bit more, you'll just pull the backing off that sequin and just put them on wherever you want on your dragon. Now I'm going to give my little dragon a bow. So I've got a piece of ribbon here and just put that around her neck and just tie that onto the paper. So far, that's what your dragon is going to look like. Then you're going to take your straws and a piece of scotch tape and tape the straw to one side of your dragon and take another piece of tape and the other straw oops, and tape that to the front of your dragon. And there you have it. There is your puppet dragon. Now I'd love to see what your puppet dragons look like. So if you want to take a picture and put it in the comment section of this uh, video, uh, I'd love to see them. So I hope you're having a great summer and we'll see you soon. Bye. <music>